Hey guys, Barnes12 here, and welcome to another Roblox Place Review. Today, we are looking at Christmas Rush, the seasonal Christmas game in Roblox. So, I'll be reviewing this every Christmas season until my days of YouTube are done. So, uh, well, Roblox YouTubing. Anyway, um, so, I will, as always, a link will be in the description. Um, this is a seasonal game that's only opened in, uh, December through a little bit after New Year's. So, make sure to get to the game now. Anyway, so, in this game, you are one of Santa's elves, and you need to make as many toys as possible. So, um, there are a variety of different toys that you can create. So, let's get started with something simple. Um, let's see. Oh, here we go. And also, your currency in this game is cookies, which is strange, but it works because, you know, Christmas cookies, you know. Anyway, so let's grab. So, just go up to this... Uh, anything like this, like this, this little shelf here. Now, this right here is a workbench, which is very similar to what you have in Minecraft. What you can use this for is combining certain items. And there are only certain items you can actually craft together. So, anyway, so let's go up to this plush collection. And you have a selection of different plushes you can use. So let's get the... This one's new, so let's get this one. So now we press exit. And now, this is actually flat. So we can't just give a child a flat plushie. Now, can we? We have to stuff it. So let's go up to the stuffing machine and click on it in our inventory. So you can see right here, this is our inventory right here. Now we wait five seconds and we've got a dog plush. Now we can't quite put it in the sleigh yet though. It needs to be wrapped. So there is different stations you can go to. So right what I went into was the stuffing machine station. And now we go to the wrapping tables, which is in this, this here building. I can't speak at all. So once again, just go up to the table and put it in. Four, three... Two, one, bam. Wrapped dog plush. Now we can put it in the sleigh. Now I think every room has at least one workbench in it. Um, so yes, but of course, Town Hall has a lot of workbenches in it. So let's go show you that real quick. Here we go. So it's got six. Now in, that, in Town Hall, there's a couple things here. You can actually use the jukebox, but it costs five Robux because it used to be ten tickets, but of course now it's... Uh, you know, tickets is gone. So, anyway, you can play from this selection of songs here, and you're going to have to play, and you, or pay five Robux for it. But it will play, so it's pretty cheap, five Robux. And, of course, you can also buy cookies right here. I'm not entirely sure what you can use these cookies for yet. I don't think you can really use them for anything right at the moment. Um, I really don't think there is anything you can do with them, actually. Um, oh, I think you can actually use... Oh, no, no, no. You can use these at the shops. So, we got some shoulder pets right here. And let's look at all these. I don't really need these, so... Yeah. And we've got the pet shop. And then the upgrade shop. So, right over here, this... Uh, oh, look at this. We've got decreases production time. I could buy, actually, some of these. Let me buy some of these. Upgrade maxed. So, normally, it would... Uh, so, let's uh, buy that. And buy that. There we go. So I got everything. Wait. Oh, so so uh, this could be upgraded. So these are upgrades, of course. So anyway, so I actually haven't looked at those at all. So uh, yeah, so I didn't actually know that. So anyway, so right over here we have Santa's big giant bag. So we click on it and deposit the gift. There we go. And you can see it gave us six cookies. Now, the more steps it takes to make a gift the more cookies it's going to give you. So let's try making something complicated, like an RC. So first we need to get some plastic. And of course, if you want to learn how to make everything, go to the left of your screen. You've got the crafting book right here. And it will tell you just exactly how to make every single item in the game. So I'm just going to show you a couple. So let's make an RC tank, shall we? So let's put the plastic in. One. There we go. So now we've got the RC tank body. This is actually an example of something we're going to need to uh, work, use the workbench for. So right next door is the storage warehouse. We're going to need two things from here. We're going to need some batteries, or just one battery actually, and a remote control. And now let's use the workbench that's provided right here. And we combine the remote and the battery for a powered remote. There we go. Now, oh, well, let me grab a piece of string so I can show you something afterwards. This does not go with the tank, but it will go for something afterwards. So, 
let's go ahead and let's go actually you know what? it's right there so i'll show you what we can do with this string now this is if you have the wizard pass uh from the store uh which is, or the passes thing in the game so this is the infusing table so let's grab this and only a certain items can be infused with magic so let's use this string we're gonna put some magic into it and now it's a gravity coil look at that wouldn't that be awesome if we could get that in real life anyway so of course now we can wrap this gravity coil but i'm gonna do that in a minute once i'm finished with this so uh, right now, this tank doesn't look like it's ready yet, so what we need to do is we need to paint it. So let's go there. There it is, right there. Oh, and these guys right here, they give you quests. Uh, get out of here, Norton. Uh, so they give you quests, and they will reward you cookies if you complete the quest. So let's put this in there. So it looks like it's one extra second that's been decreased. Or one less second, excuse me. So it looks like it's ready, right? Let's try it. It's actually not ready. Because there's one more step we need to do here to make an RC thing. I actually got stumped on this for a long time, I remember, last year. But I remember now, and what we need to do is go to the blacksmith area. And Santa actually gives you quests, too. Uh, or assignments, rather. Um, and he'll reward you cookies for it. So we need to grab a metal block. And don't worry, these collections here, they are infinite. They don't, you know, go away at all. So let's go to the anvil. And it's automatically set for us, so we just need to make a gear. So we make a gear. Mm-hmm. And now, gear. Oh, if you want to change it to something else, just click on the item. A picture of the item. So now we need to use the workbench once again. Combine this with the gear. Make an RC tank. And then combine this again to make RC tank with remote. So there we go. Now we have to wrap these two items. And then these should give us a, a good amount of cookies. Because these things, well, at least the tank should. But since the gravity coil is magic, it should be pretty good too. And it's also... A very rare chance of you getting something called the Golden Gift. And what that will do is it, it's like a special gift that will give you a lot of cookies when you deposit it in the sleigh. It's extremely rare. Like one in a million kind of rare. That's the kind of rare we're talking about here. I have gotten it before. And actually, there's an example of it right here. This is it right here. This is what it would look like. Right here. This is the Golden Gift. Um, but it is extremely rare. Uh, so let's put this in there. So we've got this, 8 cookies, and 16 cookies. Look at that. Look at that. Well, also, I did have the cookie multiplier, so... Yeah. But anyways, um, so let's go make one more thing. Oh, let's go to the Lumber Hill. I haven't shown you that yet. Oh, and right here is the coal mines. You can also, uh, you know, make coal for kids. Just basically mine a piece of coal and just wrap it up. Or you could infuse it with magic and make it into something else. Uh, but I will leave that as a secret. So anyway, let's grab a wooden block. And let's actually make a guitar. How about that? Let's make a guitar, shall we? And we're going to need a few items for this. So let's make the guitar base. There we go. we got the guitar base. Now we're going to have to go to the storage warehouse and get some strings. Of course, you know, what's a what's a guitar without some string, eh? Um, let's Wait, what's closer? Actually, you know what? It looks like the... Uh, or no, st you know, let's go. Let's go here. So all these little NPCs will give you quests. So let's go over here. Um, and also, this hot chocolate, you can buy it for a few Robux, and it will give you a five-minute speed boost when you drink it. Uh, so here we go. Oh, and there's a ball collection, and you can just air pump it. Uh, so anyway, what was I doing? Oh, yes, grabbing some string. There we go. Uh, come on. There we go. Now we need to paint the guitar base. Uh, so let's go to the painting station, shall we? Do, 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 do. With this, I pretty much should have showed you each of the stations. Let's go to the painting building. And make sure, remember, that if you think the thing is done, make sure to try and wrap it together. Or, not together, just try and wrap it. Okay, guitar base. Okay, now we use the crafting table, which is what I'm going to call it, because it's pretty much what it is. And we've got a guitar. Now, what I'm going to do with this one is I'm going to infuse it with magic. And when you infuse it, infuse, it, just, infuse it with magic, it uh, is worth more. So I'm going to infuse this with magic. So let's make this a magical guitar. I think that's what it's called anyway. So let's do this. Two, one. Yep, magic guitar. Look at that. Isn't that cool? So now let's go wrap this puppy up. I'm wondering if a thing is magic, there might be a more of a chance of it being a golden gift. That's what—that's probably what it should be. Anyway, so I'm hoping this will be a golden gift. Please, 
golden gift. It probably won't won't happen, but we're gonna. I'm just gonna hope. Hope, please, please, please. Nope, nothing. Oh, and also you'll notice right down here, there is. Uh, this is our energy, and uh, the more we run around, the more we uh, lose stamina. And uh, I have it set to auto eat, so every time you run out of stamina, it will you will eat one of your cookies. Uh, but, you know, it doesn't last long because, you know, sugar rust doesn't really last long. So, anyway, so let's deposit that. There we go. And, anyway, guys, oh, and if you want to click on Santa right here, it'll give you some assignments. Uh, and let's finish that. There we go. Ten cookies. Current assignment. Click, uh, new assignment. There we go. So, create ten rope heads. So, that is my, and I can also go to new if I don't want to do that one, which I don't really want to do a rope head. Nine polar blade plushes. Okay, that will work. So anyway guys, thank you very much for watching, make sure to subscribe, and as always, a link in the description will be there to this game, that was worded really well, um, uh, let me reword that, a link will be in the description if you want to go play this game for yourself, and remember, it's only opened for a little while, so, and then it will be closed until Christmas time rolls around again, but this year it actually opened on, uh, on July, because, on July, on July for Christmas in July, I don't know if he's gonna do that again, but we'll have to see. Anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. Make sure to subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!